Ugh. All right, here we are. I'm gonna... I'm pretty sure we have to be on this floor, don't we? Yeah. I have been planning on doing a playthrough of Bandy and the Unique Machine. I just don't know if I want to do the... First one, or uh, the new one that came out. The new one looks pretty good from uh, the screenshots I've seen. But I definitely plan on playing it. I've never played it before. All right, let's get a refresh here. I know the guy who plays in this game, but I forgot his name. <laughs> Oh, whoever he is, I, I kind of hope he does more horror games like this, or this game company who made that made this. I hope they use him again. Floor one. Okay. He's, uh, he's actually quite terrifying. I love the way they use him in the live action parts. Like seeing him go by cameras on the animations. That's very well done. So, we need to go to floor one. I guess Jimmy's on floor three. Don't let them play their themselves, you know what I mean? Ooh. Jimmy! Oh. I like that Septicai, Markiplier, and anti damage except guy plays as Sean Flynn. Huh. Is it Dr. Bose? It's rough out here. All right, let's see what's going on with him spitting out blood. It looks like he got punched in the face. I saw you spitting out blood. What happened? Play Benny in the Dark Revival after Benny in the... Okay. Jimmy. Oh. Okay. Jimmy. Oh. Dude, you started eating glass, nearly swallowed glass, and you're like, let's not go to the police about this. You are a special kind of stupid, doctor. <laughs> My god. Uh, what was the coil of wire used for? It belonged to Jimmy. He always mm. kept it in his pocket. He didn't tell me what he used it for. Ugh. Man starts choking on glass, and he's like, ah, let's just up the dosage of medicine. When you said you needed to step up Jimmy's treatment urgently. This is gonna have something to do with the medicine. With the blood -stained cloth? It isn't gonna be this, it'll be the medicine. Uh, I think it's gonna be this and the... Uh, I think this. When you said you needed to step up Jimmy's treatment urgently. Does that have something to do with what you said about the Jimmy's a psychopath. Yes, he is. <laughs> It's getting late here, so I'm, out. so I'm gonna head to bed. Have a good rest of the stream, and I'll see you around. Alright, Tuckles, always good to see you, man. Always good to see you, man. Uh, have a great rest of your night, and uh, I'll see you later, dude. Stay safe. Have a good night, man. Alright, so it's showing we need to get to floor two. We gotta be getting close, right? Oh my this god! Won't hurt Jimmy. Oh. All you have to do is to stand still and stop moving around. Oh my gosh, man. That got me worse than Jimmy himself. Oh. Ah. Ah. Oh. God. Is it Dr. Bose? Oh. Okay, it's too desperate. Thank goodness he's in one of the rooms. Maybe he's in this one. My heart Hugo Punch and his comedy monologues. Great, Claire says Claire Jones Staincliff. Funny says John Commercial Mirfield. Unusual Jewel Julie Ramsbottom Hanjin Elton. Starring at the Seaview Hotel. Show from 9 p.m. to midnight. Oh yeah. What a lovely smile this guy has. What a lovely smile. How lovely. Boy, is he just the happiest guy in the world? All right, let's, since that we're here, let's uh, quickly check and see if Mr. Doctor Man is in here. Uh, Dr. Bose. Is anyone there? <sighs> got me. It got me too, Stanley. <laughs> got me too. Hello? Yeah, they crap my pants. That scared me more than uh, the actual, like, 
<laughs> the actual Jimmy or Hugo Punch. Oh yeah, we have to, have, to both. have to find out who it is. Yes, it's me. Okay, so it is Dr. Bose. I saw you with a needle talking to Jimmy. <gasps> what were you doing? Jimmy Diffuse let me administer the drug. I had to chase him mm. around the hotel. Then he told Rose I tried to force him to take it. That I'd used violence. It was ridiculous. That's not good. That's a good way to get lawsuited right there. Where's Hugo Punch? I don't know. He doesn't know who Hugo Punch is? Okay. Check the other room real quick. See if there's something in there. I don't think I've checked this other room. But I just want to make sure Jimmy isn't Mr. Jimmy. Hello there. Oh god, I just heard him. I just heard his footsteps. Holy moly. Just heard footsteps on my right. Oh, yep, yep, yep. There he is. Go, 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 go. Oh, please don't cave me in the face, man. Please don't. Oh, I had the key too. I could have locked him. I'm so dumb. Okay, I guess it really doesn't matter because he's actually stupid. He didn't see me going here. <sighs> All right. Well, next time I will make a note of it to use this room key. Will he try and come back in here again? If he does, I'm going to just lock it. All right, I don't hear no more footsteps. Maybe we're good this time. Can we? Okay, yeah, that's very distant. <sighs> okay. Let's see if there's anything in here, evidence that we could use. Hello? Aha! We're getting baseball bats. That sounds important. Nope. Go through the door. Thank you. All right. Okay, just making sure. Man, the motion blur man, half the time if I see something even slightly shiny like a bald spot, I always think it's Jimmy. I'll never look at bald spots the same way again like I do with Jimmy. Is anyone there? Oh. Is it Dr. Bose? In case we forget wh who we're talking to. Of course. And Dr. Bose, yes. Dr. Bose. Hello, Dr. Bose. Uh, what, what are the, the crickets what are these for? Bats for? When you said Jimmy refused to let you administer his medicine, does that have something to do with what you said about the crickets and baseball bats? Maybe. No, okay. When you said Jimmy refused to let you administer his medicine, is that connected to what you said about the wooden paddle? Let's see. Jimmy said I used the paddle to beat. Aha! Uh -huh. Boy, Jimmy's a manipulator. Hmm. All right. Let's use the mirror and see where we got to go next. What's next on the list? The doctor guy. Gee, okay, so we gotta go to ground floor. I bet we might have to use the Hugo comedy thing now. So ground floor. Three. Three. Yeah, that has to mean that Jimmy's on the third floor. It has to mean that. Maybe. Again, with the bathroom. For some reason, every time you use the mirror, it always faces you in the bathroom. I don't know why. Means we should be fine around here, I'd have to say, right? <laughs> oh! God! Never mind, it lied! I heard a slight footstep, my god! That's where we're at right now. So far, I have three skull caves in. Cavens. <laughs> 
Sky underscore is Gilol has joined the cool dudes. Sky, thank you so much for the follow. Thank you for joining the cool dudes, man. Hope you enjoy your stay here, man. Thank you, thank you. Welcome aboard, partner. All right, I got a feeling where we need to go is here. We already got our spirit box, right? Yes, we did. Good. Looks like there's some ghosts in here. Right? I yep, there he is. I never use force like that on a patient Mrs. Hall. It goes hmm. against everything I believe in. You have to understand he's making it all up. The resolution to the live action like cutscenes in this game are so good. I love them. They're not cheesy. They're not low res. They're not like pixelated. They're really good. Is Very well done. Pose? They're like my favorite parts of this game. All right, let's see what Dr. Bose was talking I about. I trying to explain what happened with Jimmy. You seem desperate. I was worried that Rose would believe Jimmy. I think she might have. Ooh, that's good. And friend, you have the time. Yes, that's true. So that says VHS. Oh, floor two. Floor two. All right, that's our next stop. Floor two. I think we'll take the stair, the stairs this time. Game, yeah. dude. I believe in you, dude. Oh my you God. Can't get away from me that easily, Jimmy. <laughs> I'm not Jimmy. I think we should start again, don't you? Why don't you do what I ask you to do this time? That would be a good start, wouldn't it? Oh, that's so creepy. <laughs> Just a dude sitting on a bed. You thought you could outsmart me, Jimmy. You think you're all that in a bag of fries, Jimmy. Is it Dr. Bose? <laughs> yes, I'm Dr. Bose. All right, let's see what he knows. I saw you sitting on a bed talking to Jimmy. Let's see what we got what are here. What you doing? Yeah, what was you doing chilling there, dude? Oh yeah, of course. Yeah, sure, of course the worst. All right, what do you know about the crossbow? Where was the crossbow from? Interesting, okay. What are those rusty old keys for? I don't know. Hmm. I actually have a huge disliking towards Dr. Bose. He scares me in a weird way. He does too, like, I will say, like, aside from Jimmy caving my face in four times in a row, I think, uh, I think the part that got me the most in terms of like the ghost events or like the spirits having like a past kind of thing was uh, turning around and just seeing the doctor with a huge needle getting ready to stick it inside of me. Did not, did not appreciate that. Anyways. Uh, see you what he says about this. You another lie about you. A much worse lie. Does that have anything to do with what you said about the crossbow? And that's a no, so he's gonna do a vague scrapbook and this. You said Jimmy made up another lie about you. A much worse lie. Does that have something to do with what One you said? One of the three closest cutscenes in the game. Yeah, I wouldn't be surprised. It was really up up in your face. Jimmy accused me of the worst crime possible. He took it from a newspaper story he'd read. He was making really? it all up. Jimmy is a very manipulative man. Oh, those are police lights. He's trying to throw the doctor in jail. My ears. That is so loud every time it's over. Just just the, the ringing sound. Ugh. All right. Let's see what's our next stop. At least give us some clues. <laughs> Jimmy. Jimmy, Jimmy, Jimmy. Where is it going to be? G. Okay. I really want to go to the third floor to see if I can find that key, but I also risk getting face kicked in. Keeps telling me there's something on the third floor I need. Maybe I should go up there. So I could take the stairs instead of the elevator, maybe. I haven't heard Jimmy in a while. I just heard him. 
Okay, that door is locked. Good, good. I'm glad it is. Like that. Wow! Todd. I was just looking around. I didn't even think this was the room. All right, so who is this guy? It's Dr. Bose, isn't it? Dr. Bose. Okay, Dr. Bose. Uh. I saw you upset and heard the police banging on the door. What was going on? What was going on, Dr. Bose? Rose reported me. I knew they'd strike me off. I had no career, no future. Hmm. I wonder what does that mean? Uh oh. Who wrote the note that says goodbye? Let's see what he says about there. I don't know. Okay. When you said you decided to take control once and for all, does that have anything to do with what you said about the washing line and rolling pin? I experimented. Knew it. But it was too thin. I found some rope instead. I still had my keys mm. at the hotel, so I crept in one night while I was off bail. Ah, so he was kind of convicted, wasn't he? LG. All right. Well, that's the next. That's the next stop. All right. Let's see. Where's the guy at? He'll probably maybe be over here in this area because these doors right now. Let's see what the compass says. Uh, yep. There it is. This way. Yep. Rope. There it is. What are you gonna do there, buddy? Uh, uh, what what are you doing? Uh, no, don't, no, 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 don't, don't, no, don't do it, no! Oh my God! Oh my God! That is like, oh gosh, oh that my neck hurts now. Oh my neck hurts. Oh, oh that's oh. Oh, that's so graphic. Oh, oh, that's like an, a, it's slow, but quick. Like it's like a, like a millisecond of your neck snapping because of that. Oh, I saw you tying a rope around your neck. Ugh. You killed yourself. Why? <laughs> Don't want to think about it. I'd had enough. There was no going back. My life was over anyway. That's awful, dude. That's awful. The dude was probably going to spend the rest of his day in prison because he was falsely accused anyway. So, I mean, I guess he just didn't want to live his rest of his life in prison. Which I feel very bad for. Oh, that's a stage. Okay. Stage. All right. Well, to the stage. There we go. It was a bug. Holy moly. We found a bug. <laughs> it was a bug. Wow. Behold. And the great Hugo. Oh dang, this is cool. Okay, I think I kind of understand why it bugged out because this is really cool. Seems awesome, dude. I love that. That was really cool looking. It was so cool that I passed out on the ground. Okay, yeah. So it was bugged. That's very strange. You noted the great Hugo on stage. Yeah, that was really cool. I like that. I wasn't expecting that. Oh, oh, oh! It's dangerous. It's dangerous. It's dangerous. It's dangerous. He's gonna know, man. He's gonna know. Oh, no. He left. Okay, that's good. Uh, no, not the closet. I don't know about you, but I've, I've had more luck. Did I leave it? Oh. Whoa, crap. Gosh, imagine he's just hiding in the bathroom. Using the restroom real quick before he continues. Jimmy likes to stay in the bathroom when you go into the closet. Oh. 
That sucks. He likes to take his poop before he gets us, huh? It still says danger. I think I might have to just get hit by Jimmy. I might just have to take it. Maybe try and leave. I think you're safe now. Yeah. Oh, yeah, no. He was chilling. He was chilling. Oh. All right, let's try this one. Maybe it was the... Oh, there it is. Jimmy. I know you can hear me. I know you made it up, your little story about that psychiatrist. Oof. I know where you got it from. I knew I'd read it before. It's in your bloody scrapbook. Come out here. Wow, that's really cool. Jimmy. They actually, like, hold the items in the game. That's really cool. Wow. Oh, and now Jimmy took his place. Oh, God. Uh... Now, let's try it here. Hello? How can we hear you? There we go. Okay, what a weird spot. Oh. Is it Harvey? Say who he is. Yeah. Okay, Mr. I Harvey. Saw you shouting, telling Jimmy to admit he lied. Did he? Of course he didn't. He just laughed. Best spot to die, I guess. Yeah, of course. Best place to get your head caved in. I saw someone on stage, a performer, announcing himself as the great Hugo. <sighs> he never knew him. Okay. Do you know I anything saw about this guy? Tying a rope around his neck. He killed himself. Why? Because he'd been driven too. Everyone thought he'd wow. watched Jimmy. Jimmy was clever, you see. Too clever. Wow. Dang, man. That's crazy. When you said Jimmy started setting traps... This has got to be a... Does that have anything to do with what you said about the dangerous heater? It has to be, right? Jimmy was always playing with that Yes! I knew it! He was never the one who got shocked. Or one. Don't hit me in the face. And I don't. I don't have the thing for it. Uh. Alright, let's go back to the ground floor where the kitchen is. This would be a nice, safe spot to be. Eight corners. Oh, yeah, okay, it's here. There, okay. Oh. Oh my god. <laughs> oh my god. Oh, wow. Wow. Okay. The door just closes. Jimmy POV bonk. <laughs> I'm only going to guess it wants us to talk in here, Is right? He usually talk to spirits in the dark, like uh, phasmophobia. Yeah, I thought so. Oh, this is really creepy just being in the dark. All right, let's, uh, so, uh, about that shock, Jimmy. I saw you suffering an electric shock. <laughs> about that shock. What happened? Oh, well, there's the hint right there. Something about damaging property, huh? It's going to have something to do with the broken mirrors. It has to be, right? How about this? He decided to damage his property. Does that have something to do with what you said about the crickets and baseball bats? And I kept those bats for self defense. But I was angry. Ah. I took one and went to Jimmy's room. You took one and went to Jimmy's room. Oh, God. Ooh, two. Gotta go to floor two. Uh. Wow, that is so creepy. Oh, there we go. Uh. 
Oh, he's about to do something. He's about to do something really bad. Ugh. I still can't get over how good the live action is in these, like, ghost events, man. I, I can't get over it. I, I, how they did this is, like, so impressive. I would love to know if they have a behind-the-scenes thing, because I would love to watch it. Like, man, they, there's no clipping with their feet through the floors or anything. It, it's straight up real people in a game. It's Is incredible. It Can't get over that. Yeah, it's Harvey. <sighs> All right, Harvey, you mind explaining what you're doing with that you bat? With that coming out of the room. What have you done? I smashed up his television and games consoles and stuff. Game consoles. <laughs> Yeah, I don't know, man. Violence doesn't cause like violence doesn't get anyone nowhere. When you said Jimmy soon retaliated. retaliated. Does that have anything to do with what you said about the crossbow? Retaliated. Jimmy was fond of weapons. Like yes, okay. I hadn't seen him all night after it smashed his stuff. There we go. Ooh. Okay, so still floor two. That room with the Tell, that's a match. I think that's a match. Okay. Hmm. Interesting, interesting. Okay. If I just had enough time, I could have locked him in. Oh. Wait, this is 215. I don't think this is the 215 room. Is it? Nope. I was incorrect. Fudge. Oh well. Whoa! Jesus! Jimmy! Oh! <laughs> oh my gosh! I thought that was Jimmy standing at the front door. Harvey being shot in the leg. Oh my god! My oh! Oh gosh! You scared me so bad. Is it Harvey? Dang! Yeah, I thought that was Jimmy. Okay, jump scare, 10 out of 10. Knock, knock, bitch. Oh. I saw you being shot in the leg with an arrow. I thought what that happened? was Jimmy. I thought that was Jimmy saying, oh, hello there. Jimmy had set it up to fire when I opened the door. Oh. Every day into A and E get stitches and tetanus shots. And at the back, I couldn't find him. Rose said he was hiding in the basement. Oh. <laughs> he had an idea. I'm sorry, did you say an idea? How about the Who hand? Does the gun belong to? What, what's the handgun belong to? <laughs> this one's mine. Belonged to my father. Still had a few rounds of it. Well, uh, wait a minute. You're telling me that gun had bullets in it and she didn't think to take that? Was there a fire at the hotel? Oh my. Yeah. They managed to contain it, but I lost a lot of stuff. A lot of stuff. <sighs> oh man, I'm still coming down. When you said you thought Jimmy would like hiding in the basement, does that have something to do with those rusty keys? Well, if Jimmy wanted to hide that, uh -huh. he must like it. Jimmy is a is a great and true mechanic maniac. He actually is. Like, he got a little girl to commit. Well, no, no, no. he got a little. Oh, LG. We have to go to uh, the lower ground. Okay, yeah, he's definitely close now. I think he is either psychopath or sociopath. Only the bad side of him, though. The new one is just okay. That is true, because he does have this thing called. Whoa! Whoa! Jesus! What are you doing crawling on the floor? Oh, I've never seen that. Oh, God. Oh, dude, why would you do that? You know I'm in here, dude. There's nobody does that. Nobody does that and not know that you're in there, dude. Holy. I hear banging. All right. Oh, yep. All right. It's here. I'm going to quickly check keys. Okay. Oh, hey, you buddy. You stay in there for the night, Jimmy. Ha. I'm ready to go. Oh, dude. This is never going to end well. Dude, look at the shadows, though. The shadows of the of uh the guy, Harvey. Like, the shadow. Like, putting shadows in game. Like, that is not easy. That is not easy. There's no way. Wow. God, these graphics. Hello. Make another one, please. Make another one. Add Dead of Night 2, please.
Wish the compass was a little more accurate in what it does. Is someone there? Is there someone here? Wait a minute, what? Why is it at the top on the ground floor? Uh, uh, stupid. I saw you locking Jimmy in the basement. <laughs> Excuse me. What happened? You didn't know them? Yeah. Probably couldn't do any damage down there. Do any damage in the basement? He, it's him. He set the place he on fire. Wrong to think Jimmy couldn't do any damage in the basement. He set the place on Is fire. Is that connected to what you said about the fire in the hotel? It has to be. Nobody realized how much yes. I don't know, man. You, the, you knew that Jimmy killed two people. And you're saying you underestimate him. I don't know about that, man. I'm just saying. Like, the guy did manage to kill a little girl and his doctors, so I mean... Harvey realized Jimmy was crazy. Wow. <laughs> wow, Harvey, you're just as bright as Maya, dude. <laughs> Took you this long to realize he was crazy? <laughs> I can't help it. Oh, yeah, something's about to happen. Oh, wow. Okay. Wow. That was really cool. I find it very weird how all these people think that, like, these drastic measures will help Jimmy. Jimmy needed a real psychologist. Like... Locking someone up in a basement is only going to make it worse. Making fun of the game characters. I'm only making fun of the game characters because I love the game, honestly. I'm doing it out of love. I, I love this game. When you said you wanted Jimmy gone, does that have something to do with what you said about the gun? It's going to have to be, right? That's how you get rid of people. Yep. Ah, uh, he blacked out. He was violent. Okay, makes sense. Floor two. Handgun. That's where we gotta go. Floor two. All right. Floor two it is. Here we go. Time to get our face bashed in once again. All right. Bing bong. Is he over here? All right. He's actually a little ways away, actually. There we go. Oh. Get out of the hotel, Jim. Hello there. Get out of my hotel. This is my hotel. Get out of my hotel, Jim. Is it Harvey? Oh, he's this way. Yes. There we go. Hello, Harv. I saw you with a gun. Practicing with it. What were you going to do? Practicing with it. I don't know what I was going to do. Threaten him, get him out of the hotel, go up the walls. I didn't realize he was going to be on too. Come on, Jimbo. I need you to... There you are. Hey! Hey, buddy. How you doing? One, two, three, four, five. All right, now's the time to book it. Go! Oh, run, 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 run. Oh, 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 God, oh, God, oh, God, oh, God, oh, God. Ah, 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 ah. Oh, I heard him. Oh, 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 God, run. Keep running. Epic chase music. Oh, 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 get in. Oh, oh, God. Oh, yes, he was chasing me. Oh, God. Oh, my God, that scared me. Oh, I wonder if anyone's ever tried that. Has anyone ever tried to like, <laughs> cause you know, Jimmy knew if I turned around, he would have known. I wonder if anyone's ever tried to book it like that. My God. When you said you didn't realize Jimmy would be armed too. Does that have anything to do with what you said about the dagger? It's gotta be right. Gotta be. It wasn't even a dagger. Huh. I never let my lesson. Jimmy was always one step ahead of me. People with these types of things, they are, they usually are well ahead of you. 
<clears throat> I've played 50 plus gamers play this game and I have to admit you really did the great chase there. Oh, thank you. I always wondered if anyone ever tried that, you know, like I love getting chased after monsters. It's always been my favorite thing about horror games. Like, man, I, I bet you, you can do it, but you cannot turn around. I bet if you turn around, like you get bonked instantly. Here we go. Oh, hey, buddy. You noted Harvey headed towards the ballroom. Wait, what was that? Someone yell? Oh. Wow, that is scary hearing this guy scream. It has to be in the back here, right? Jimmy. Yeah, it is, but where? Whoa, hey! What the <laughs> oh gosh, I know it was supposed to be scary, but hearing his last words be J mate. <laughs> oh. That's great. That's great. Yeah, it's Harvey. Ooh. That was very realistic though. Very well done. I saw you being stabbed backstage. What happened? Oh man. Ooh. Jimmy crept up behind me. I didn't see it. Jimmy always won in the end. That's very strange, man. He isn't killing me. He just keeps bonking me, but okay. This guy killed everybody else. I love the ghost hunting aspect of it, though. It's really cool. I get over it. Oh, there's Hugo. That's definitely Hugo on stage for sure. Ooh, uh, I know that room. That's like, uh, crap. I forgot what floor that was. I think it was floor three. Okay, we completed Harvey's story. Nice. Yeah, that was definitely Har that's Harvey's room. Uh, or, um, that's the third floor. We go finally. Jimmy. It was just a letter opener. It was self defense. Look. I think I just heard his footsteps. I'm not going to second guess it. Okay. He sounds. Okay. I'm so high right now. This is not fair. Don't smash. Oh, I just. Oh, 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 no, 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 oh, God. Oh, my God. I just saw his face. Oh, no. How did he not kill me? Oh, oh why is Jimmy being such a douche right now? Oh, I just saw him out of the corner of my eye. Oh boy, he's here. This is horrible. This is awful. I can't even find this ghost because this dude keeps harassing me. Oh my gosh, this guy is giving me a heart attack. I wanna, oh my gosh. He, his, he's moving quicker is what I've noticed. I feel like he's not moving as slow. But when he does, it's just, it, it's non-existent. Who's there? Are you in here? Are you, it would be very weird if you're in here. I can hear you. Why are you in here? Oh, that's so weird. That's so strange. Okay, whatever. We found it. Oh. Uh, let's make What's sure. Let's ask who she is. Rose. Rose Hall. Rose Hall, okay. Another proprietor? It must be the wife, I'd have to say. Probably the wife to, uh... What's I saw name? a lady explaining that the dagger was a letter opener. Who was she? He did not act in self-defense. You crazy. Okay, that's a car that's outside of the building. Creepy character girl. Oh, hey, this is the storeroom. I just noticed you can just, you can just do that. Probably doesn't do nothing. Jimmy was a good guy all along. Dun, dun, dun. 
Yeah, you're probably right, honestly. Maybe he's just misunderstood. <laughs> he's just misunderstood, you know? It's just how it is. So now it wants us to go to the ground floor, and it wants us to go to the third floor, too. He just bonked us to save us, yeah. He's just upset that we're... I think he's just upset that we're not going to have his breakfast or see his show tonight. Kind of makes sense. This is the worst room to yell hey out of because, like, you have no... You have no view of him. I hear footsteps, so he's relatively close. Our friends want to kill us. That's why he kidnapped them. Oh, yeah, that is true. Oh, I hear the footsteps. I hear it. It's crazy how the ambiance is so hard to hear his footsteps. Ugh. <laughs> yeah, no, you are actually the one that isn't seen. And he's just trying to uh, calm you down with a baseball bat. Yeah, 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 yeah. That sounds right. Oh! I heard that. He really likes checking this area out, man. He just moves. I need him to be farther away. I don't hear no footsteps now. I'm gonna take my chance. ground floor here I come getting out of this crazy place Whew. okay <laughs> gosh it's so weird like it's not like there's no dramatic music or anything it's literally like a stealth game where whoever's stealthiest wins it's like the it's like the scariest cat and mouse game ever like, you'd figure after a while you would get scared, like, you wouldn't be so scared of Jim anymore, but gosh, I'm still terrified of this guy. Exactly, psychology game. Yeah, uh, that's exactly what it is. It's perfect, honestly. All right, well, we got a spirit here. Oh, that's in you. Oh, here we go, finally. Jimmy. Hate it. Oh! Oh, hi! I don't want to hug you. Did her face, like, go all, like... What's it called? Did her face go, like, all messed up? I feel like it went to skeleton form a little bit. Also, I think she might like Jimmy. Is it Rose? It's kind of strange. Who are you greeting at the entrance and reception? Ugh. Hmm. Jimmy, he was coming home. The police She's his mom. Oh. Okay. I didn't know that. Oh. Really? Who is Hugo Punch? I bet she'll know who Hugo Punch is. It was Jimmy's comedy act. Yep. So Jimmy plus this. When you said Jimmy found a way of bringing in more guests. Definitely. Is that connected to what you said about the Hugo Punch poster? Yes. That was I knew it. I am a genius. I'm sure he was. Oh, if only he wasn't so creepy, he would actually have a really good act. Oh, looks like our next evidence is here. Okay. Ladies and gentlemen. 
Whoa, hi. Yeah, dog, jazz, yeah. <laughs> oh, heck yeah, dude. Oh, that's the music that plays like in the main menu. Oh, dude, that's a slapper, lol, what the heck. Bro, that was actually slapping that jazz going on. You like jazz? Is it rice? <laughs> that was super cool. Yes, I'm Rose. You go punch. I saw you announcing Hugo Punch onto the stage. I was enjoying it. Sometimes are lining up, sometimes yeah. Everything seemed to be getting better. I noticed that too. Jimmy started behaving oddly. I heard him shouting, staring at himself. Oh, here we go. He seemed angry. What you said about Jimmy staring at himself and becoming angry, is that connected to what you said about the broken mirrors? It makes sense, right? Yes! God. That's the third floor. Well, it looks like my story is going to continue on the third floor, most likely. He's still here. You gotta be kidding me. Oh my god! <laughs> That one actually got me good. Holy crap. Oh, it's dangerous. It's dangerous. It's dangerous. Ah. I tapped out for a second and you died. Damn. Yeah. Oh, it's dangerous. Why aren't you turning? Turn, turn, turn. Oh my gosh. Oh man, those mannequins. Oh my God. I swear to gosh, Jimmy, if you're in that bathroom taking a crap, I will murder you. Is anyone there? That's pretty cool. I can hear you. She's in the dark room. Oh, that's creepy, but I like it. All right, so we Is have to make sure we have to make sure it's Rose. I saw you standing in a corridor full of mannequins. Who put them there? I think it's pretty obvious Jimmy did it. His face is on him. Ugh. The plot thickens. Oh, he ripped up the Hugo poster. All right, time to mirror it up. Ooh. Seems like we're gonna get another event in here. Did he take my compass? No, he didn't. Well, I can't open that door, so I mean. Way. Hey, hey, it's a hey. sense of humor. Oh, I'm sorry if you've been offended. Uh, excuse me. Is it Rose? Yes, I'm Rose. Hey, good. I saw you in the ballroom. The audience was booing and you were apologizing. What that was sucks. happening? I had to apologize. That's, that's pretty bad. It wasn't Jimmy on stage anymore. It was Hugo Punch's comedy character. Hugo started insulting his audience every night. Oh gosh, he did something stupid. Uh, did something stupid. And you said Jimmy uh, lost I'm his temper and did something said. stupid. Yeah, no problem, Sky. No Is problem that connected all. to what you said about the coil of wire? Jimmy locked her in a room and there we go. I didn't know what he was going to do. I found her and let her go. Jimmy said it was a joke. She didn't press charges, but she told the newspapers. Well, that's not good. That's the front door. Yeah. 
It's your grub hub calling. There we go. Uh, your order has been canceled because I saw the hotel and noped out. That's so true. I ain't gonna lie, man. The graphics are starting to remind me of like some of those uh, theme parks at uh, Universal, to be honest. All right, care to explain what was going I saw on? You upset. People were knocking on the door asking questions. Who were they? Angry customers. Wow, okay. Uh, wanted to leave everything behind and go, oh god. When you said Jimmy wanted to leave everything behind and go, is that connected to the goodbye note? Of course it is. Jimmy hated what he'd done. Aww. He'd been fighting Hugo Punch all his life. It was inside him, making him do all those bad things. Jimmy didn't want to live anymore. Hey, the 106 key. That's a random one. That's not this one. It is really... That does... Oh, there we go. Hello. Dang. Gosh, dang, man. What did you do? I saw you in a room upstairs. It looked like you found someone in the bathroom. What happened? Yeah, what happened? It was Jimmy. He tried to kill himself. Oh no! That's why I had to tell him the truth. Hold on, the truth? What, what you mean the truth? Oh yeah, I forgot about Hugo. Yeah. And an entertainer. He bought the hotel to promote his stage show. He became famous. He was on television. I worked as his assistant. Wow. Huh. Developed. Developed? Uh, yeah, that's a, that's a nice way to put it. It's a lovely way to put it. Okay, uh, that in the ring. It said things developed. When you said things developed with Hugo, is that connected to the wedding ring? Yes. Oh, I knew it! I knew it! Oh, I knew it. Oh, that's so creepy. Oh, God. Oh, have you tried looking in the bathroom? Oh, the bathroom. Oh, that hole. That's a little peculiar. I would not allow you to ruin my life. Oh, uh, your life means something. Uh, okay. Oh, that's so creepy. Oh. This sight, this sighting is so random. Yeah, wow, that was really cool looking. This is what the rattle's for. Oh, that was really cool though, man. The way that blood came in, man. Imagine this game was like, if you could use it like with 3D glasses or something. My gosh, it would be amazing. You said there was only one thing you could give Hugo. Does that have something to do with the baby's rattle? I thought having a child would solve. Uh, try going down for by any chance. I did. Gosh, that's so creepy. Ah, there we go. That's creepy. Sit still, you super lash. Do what I tell you to do. Wow, this is a really cool cutscene. That's a key. Wow. Oh my god. That dude was beating somebody. Oh my gosh. Uh, these events seem to be much stronger than the usual ghost events. As we're starting to black out every time we view them. Is that a key on the floor? Yes, it was. Gimme, gimme. I'll take that key off your hands. Oh, basement store. Okay. Basement storage. Okay. Um, Sounds good to me. That's where we'll go. 
You know, did shouting falling. All right, let's go. Uh, let's see. Is this the key? Sure is. Let's go in. Oh, lovely. It's the mannequin room. Oh, Jimmy Hall's birth certificate. Uh, 1976. Okay. I found Jimmy's birth certificate. It says Hugo Hall is Jimmy's real father. Gosh, imagine this whole time Hugo Hall is his father. That's awful. Uh. I heard a man shouting and a child crying. What happened? Ugh. Hugo was a violent, evil, sick man. Oh, the when truth. You, said you had to tell Jimmy the truth. Does that have something to do with what you said about Jimmy's birth certificate? This makes sense. Ah, okay. Oh, that's so creepy. What? Is Hugo actually another for what? Wow, that's, that's so weird. Wow, I'm still planning on sleeping tonight. I can't just sleep at class again tomorrow. Because I have a Spanish exam, I'm gonna die. I'm so sorry, dude. All right. Oh, that's a whipping noise. Oh God, that is so wrong. That's so wrong. Oh, I hear it. Oh, there it is. Oh, my gosh. Oh, <laughs> she went to town on him. I was attacked someone with a bat. I think it's pretty obvious who she attacked. It's Mr. Hugo. Makes you wonder what's happening. Yeah. All right, Rose. I saw you with a wooden bat attacking someone. Who was it? That's awful. Hugo. I buried him down there in concrete. I'm sorry, what? Secret room. Buried him. Should have done it sooner. I let him abuse Jim for too long. It was my fault Jimmy turned out the way he did. So wait a minute. So I thought the guilt would go away if I told Jimmy. You didn't realize it's her fault? Oh. When you said you couldn't live with yourself, does that have something to do with what you said about the turpentine and lighter? Turpentine and lighter? I had no oh, there we go. Okay, wow. Jimmy had gone to find Hugo's grave. Ooh. I was alone. Why? <laughs> Why I would you do that? Do. Oh, no. Gosh, man, the plot is so deep in this game. It's actually crazy. Floor two. That's where we must go. Or two it is. There we go. I really do love the whole murder mystery part and like putting puzzles together. It's really fun. Okay, that sounds far away. If he if he comes up on my face. Oh Jesus! <laughs> Thank gosh. Thank gosh. Okay, here we go. Uh that should a spirit box us. Come on, just give it to us. Okay, whoo! We got it, we got it, we got it, we got it, we got it. I saw you, you were on fire. What happened? Oh. If I hadn't done it myself, Jimmy would have. Or rather, Hugo would have. Hugo still in charge. Hugo's still in charge. Even off the. He's controlling Jimmy. I don't know what we're gonna do about that then. I'm sorry, you want us to ask Jimmy? The guy who's been beating her face in? 